Today in math, we are going to learn about analyzing data using a line graph. Today's lesson is important to you because you will be able to understand and answer questions about the data on a line graph. Let's first create the line graph using the data table. So we'll see that the graph is about number of students in class on which days. So Monday has 18. So we'll first find the 18 and go across to Monday and place a dot there. Then Tuesday with 20 up to 20 down to Tuesday. Wednesday 22 up here. Thursday 19. And then Friday with 21. Now to complete the line graph and I need to add the lines. So let's go ahead and line, add the lines between here and Tuesday, Wednesday. Wednesday, Thursday, and now Thursday, Friday. All right, now that our line graph is complete, we can answer some questions. So today I'm going to show you how to answer questions about a line graph to analyze the data on the graph. Watch me as I show you how to read the question and use the data on the line graph to answer the question. The first question, which day had the most students in class? I will look at my line graph and I will find which day it had the highest point. And here's the highest point. If I go down, I see that it's Wednesday. So it looks like Wednesday had the most students in class. Now it's your turn. Let's look at question three. How many students were in school on Monday and Tuesday? Now use the line graph to figure out the total number of students in class on Monday and on Tuesday, you can tell a friend, family member, or even a stuffed animal what you figured out. Pause the video and then come back to see if our answers match. All right, second grade, did you figure it out? I answered the question by adding the number of students on Monday, 18, plus the number of students on Tuesday, which equaled 28. If you got this, you are correct. Today I taught you how to answer questions about a line graph to analyze data. Answering questions about a line graph is important because this is going to help you to understand and analyze data that is on the line graph. Today you will be practicing this in Seesaw, answering questions on a line graph. And this is important for you because it will help you to analyze data using all different kinds of graphs.